Well, we have another day and another glorious opportunity in front of us. The responsible person seeks to make his or her whole life a response to the question and call of God. In Galatians 6 verse 10 it says, As we have opportunity, we must work for the good of all, especially for those who belong to the household of faith. Each morning we wade out into a vast sea of opportunity. And if you're not looking at your life this way, I invite you to change your vision because it will attract opportunity to you. So often, as adults, we get cynical eyes where we look at life and we say, hmm, nothing new. I've seen that, been there, done that. We have to look with eyes that see new opportunity and make the most of those opportunities once we see them. God blesses us continually, my friend, but sometimes we feel as if we're too busy and we squander those opportunities. And who do we cheat when we do that? We cheat ourselves and also we cheat others because when we grasp hold of our opportunities, we don't just do it for ourselves. It flows out overflowing from us onto others when we succeed. God wants to provide for you and for me, but we have to work with God by having the right vision to see another glorious day and another glorious opportunity. Daily demands can leave us feeling many times overworked, overcommitted, and overwhelmed. And when we get tired eyes and tired vision, we just tend to close in on ourselves. And yet God wants us to slow down enough to talk with God, to praise God, to, to listen to God's voice. And when we do, our spirits will be calmed and our lives will be enriched and amazingly, we'll find that God gives us the inner resources that we need to, to pick ourselves up spiritually and to walk forward with new energy, to grasp hold of new opportunities. It is another day. It is another glorious opportunity to place ourselves in the service of the one who is the giver of all blessings. Don't miss it. Because there is a glorious opportunity in this day. And if you can't see it yet, pray that you do.